Gladys aka is that your hair and welcome back to my channel welcome to $20 Tuesdays $20 Tuesday is a time where I showcase super cute yet super affordable units all at the lovely price of $20 and below so let's get into it all right so this unit that I have today is actually a unit I reviewed before her name is model model ebony and I have her in the honey brown color. Ebony comes with your typical cap construction, two combs in the front, a comb in the back, adjustable straps. This is a lace part wig. It's not a lace front. That means it doesn't come with any lace to cut. There is a slight line of demarcation in the front, but I simply fixed it by cutting a small V in the middle to help blend with my skin. Let me give you a quick 360 of the unit. All right, so this is Model Model Ebony. If you saw the first video I had of her, I originally got her in a 1B, and I absolutely loved Model Model Ebony in the 1B. A lot of y'all did too, and y'all literally sold out Glamour Trust out of the dark colors. Literally, none left. I was like, okay, y'all are feeling it. Let's get into the pros of this wig. First pro would definitely be the style. As I said before, I love how chic this looks. I think it's a perfect length for every day. You don't have to worry about this, you know, rubbing up all up against your clothes in the fall and the winter. So this is gonna last you a very long time. I also really love the texture. It is a light yakky texture and it feels so soft, so flowy. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. Another pro to this unit is the color. Now, as you saw in the beginning, it did come full honey brown no dark root but i showed you in the tutorial how to do the dark root with the dark root i basically use eyeshadows i use a darker brown which had like a reddish undertone and a black and i combine both of them across the parting space and i use my special brush tool to blend it together the brush tool was slightly damp when i used it because it just helps move the color further along the hair shaft and i think it gives it the illusion of a shadow root which i really like when it comes to rooting a lighter colored unit i don't really like a harsh root it just depends i think blending is really important for me this method is the easiest way to make it blend without it being too harsh so you'll see here how the root looks and i think it looks good i think it looks natural i don't really have any cons for ebony the parting came great i just had to fix the line demarcation that was the only real con i like the cut the style the color as far as the cap size she is on the medium maybe big head friendly but more on the medium side i have her adjusted to like the second to last setting right now she is almost all the way at my hairline but if you have a larger head like if you have a 22 or 23 inch head i think this will fit you pretty snug snugly but yes ebony is such a cutie i really, really love her i did find her originally on glamour trust for $13. That is the main pro to this unit. The price, y'all. $13 for this super cute, super fall ready bob. I think this is a, definitely a very nice fall color as well. I was a little hesitant about her on my skin tone, but now as I'm looking at myself, she's kind of growing on me. So let me know what you think in the comments down below about this color on me. Y'all see, I got my little Cassie neck on today. Hey, Cassie girl, I wore this for you. <laughs> I'm definitely getting more turtlenecks because of Cassie. Yeah, y'all. This is great fall hair. I mean, you can't go wrong with a nice bob, especially for $13. And even if this is not available on Glamour Trust for $13, the highest I've seen it is $20, which is still a steal. This definitely rivals a human hair bob. Absolutely. This texture 
is amazing. Amazing for it to be just a synthetic wig. If they would have said this was human hair blend, I would have believed them. Yeah, that's all I have for Ebony. Make sure you check out the initial video that I where I reviewed her in the 1B color. I think it looks so good in a dark color. And if you're not into colors like this, check it out. And if you are new to my channel, make sure you subscribe the red button down below and tap the notification bell so that you do not miss any of my upcoming videos i want to send a sincere thank you to everyone that has been following with me and rock with me especially during 20 dollar tuesdays it seems like you guys are really keeping up with the series and that's super exciting to me because i just love finding affordable wigs and i love sharing them with you all i hope the tutorial in the beginning was helpful as far as how to um, apply a dark root to a light colored wig. Let me know if it helped you in the comments down below. And if you wanna check out more of my recent videos, you can all look over here to the right of me. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.